you can develop your group's core values pretty much the same way you develop your own personal values. You take your team together, you ask everybody what's important, you figure out what general direction your, your team is headed in, you, you figure out with that what your initial general operating idea is. So you might say, this is our general objective. And then from your general objective, figure out how that plays out as principles across the areas that your team needs to work in. Say business, finance, success, relationships, and health and stability of the company. So you figure out how does this general objective play out along the various areas that your business needs to be involved in or that your group needs to work in or that your group needs to partner with. You, you figure out all the areas it's involved in and how does the general operating idea, how does the general objective play out as principles across those areas. And from those principles, you'll begin to get a feel for certain words and phrases and you'll be able to consolidate, consolidate those phrases and this will become your initial set of core values. And when you have these core values, you can rank order sequence them which comes first which is stronger than the others which if I had nothing else I could work with and once you have a rank order sequence set of values you now have a directional flow for the company or the group or the team pretty much the way we rank order sort for drivers and uh, the other arbitrary thing that we have for ourselves not the drivers but the core values so core values for self core values for team both arbitrary both chosen both rank order sequenced and you could both start from a general idea a general objective then branch out into principles across the life of your organization or across your life and then figure out the operating procedures from there which will be informed by the core values that you extrapolate or that you juice out or get from your operating principles which again stem from your general objective and then you talk it out you take it for testing does this actually work this way what works better and if it works great and if it doesn't work uh, exactly as planned you can make adjustments and do it better each time it's just one iteration and then the next learning from our mistakes doing things better so i hope this has been useful ask me if you have any other questions cheers